Uh, we tried, we got a guy with a warrant. Uh, he was supposed to come to the office, claim his car was overheating, it's complete bullshit. Yep, this is her. Hello? What's going on? Your car's overheating? He said he's having car problems. Bullshit. Try to work his hands. His court date was rescheduled for Monday. Oh, your hearing's rescheduled for Monday? He said that he just rescheduled his hearing for Monday. Bullshit. I called the clerk to confirm. It's bullshit. So. I started going to go to him, but I have now she's going to have him sign the paperwork because he actually do got to sign the paperwork. I have to turn the paperwork in to insurance this afternoon. He's going to jail too. Waterloo to Manchester? Yeah. Well, I will text you whenever I'm getting close to there, okay? Okay, you're welcome. Bye-bye. We'll see how this goes, man. Man, hey, I fucking around. I had a fire in one bar. I didn't know that I was going to have to go hunt my stomach. I got the bounty bubbles. <laughs> That's how you do it. My name is Frank Fraser. I'm a bell bondsman. I was just calling to alert the APD that I would be at the BP on Waterloo to serve an arrest. Anybody in this line of work, law enforcement um, included, you know, you got to understand that we can have an impact on these people's lives, man. And, and it's important that, you know, we sometimes, if we have the opportunity to help, we should help, you know. Um, the, the worst thing you want to do is make someone that's already addicted to drugs, that's already, you know, they're fucking up in life, make them feel like even more shit. You know, I don't need to tell them you're a scumbag, you're this and that. You don't need to tell them all that. You know, try to be encouraging, you know, and, and help them change their life around so we're not arresting the same people. You know, so be conscious of that. We have we have impact on these people's lives deeper than we know it. And, you know, just a, a positive conversation with some of these people could change your life. You just never know. Josh is not a bad guy. I'm going to try to get my man Josh to, you know, to tell his story. So he can some, you know, maybe somehow inspire someone who's going through the same thing to reach out. Uh, hey, just capture my man Josh. Not a bad guy. You know what I'm saying? Original charge, he OD on uh, heroin. What he's going to do when he gets out, what you going to do, man? Do a documentary about my lifestyle, how bad it is. It's not he's going to drugs. He's going to help people who are addicted to heroin get off this shit. Hopefully he inspires some people, do some good, get off some drugs. So that's what my man Josh going to do, man. Anybody else I can, you know, get, hey, try to give back, try to help, man. No one's perfect. You got a problem. I'm not an asshole. You know what I'm saying? I treat my man with respect that I'm not. Yep. So now I want him to help others to get off this addiction, man. So when you get out, like I said, I help you. You know what I'm saying? Just help others. Man. All right.